Hi, my name is David Emerson. I'm a long-term multiple myeloma survivor and myeloma cancer coach. Welcome to uh, the vlog, blog post regarding one of the most common questions that newly diagnosed myeloma patients have. What is the difference between turmeric and curcumin? Both are sold. Uh, go to Amazon, go online. Yes, you should be, you the myeloma patient, should be interested in this therapy. Um, hundreds of studies bearing out the efficacy. The challenge is understanding uh, the minutia, uh, what each is. Here is the deal. Turmeric is uh, the root um, and uh, tumorones are um, helpful, can be helpful to myeloma, can be sold as a supplement. However, curcumin is extracted from turmeric and is um, a pure form of uh, the good stuff. To take that even a little further, there are those therapies, uh, let me state for the record, <clears throat> Even curcumin is notoriously difficult to get into our bloodstream. <clears throat> Just taking a capsule of 1,000 milligrams of pure curcumin might not get much of the good stuff into our blood. That's the trick. There are um, many formulas, many brands, that have figured out how to enhance the bioavailability of curcumin, in some cases dozens, hundreds of times more than just plain curcumin. This blog post has a number of uh, brands listed. I myself have no uh, skin in the game. Um, your decision is yours. Um, I oftentimes tell people what I use, and it's a, a form of um, BCM-95, Enhanced Bioavailability Curcumin. But there are many others. Some people swear by um, the addition of black pepper, bioprene. Some people swear by um, curcumin, uh, sort of an oil-based. The point is, uh, the dose is not only, not exclusively, um, milligrams or grams but it's also the bioavailability of the particular formula that you, the patient, are undergoing. So, turmeric, curcumin, bioavailability, and total dose. I know that's complicated. Uh, if you have questions, feel free to email me. I will uh, answer your questions to the best of my ability. Curcumin, the bottom line is curcumin is an excellent evidence-based non-toxic therapy for multiple myeloma. It's worth it for you to do a little bit of homework to figure out what is best for you. So if you have any questions, comments, email me, scroll down the page, uh, send me a question or a comment, I will reply to you ASAP. In the meantime, be well and I look forward to working with you soon. Thank you for your time.